Our next guest has lived for more than a year without a human heart. Stan Larkin is a young man who suffers from a condition which can cause his heart to fail without notice. But thanks to a device stored in a backpack called Syncardia, he was able to survive the 555 days leading up to his heart transplant. Joining us now on the line from the University of Michigan Hospital is Stan Larkin. Good morning, Stan. How are you doing? Good and you? Good morning. Now, first tell us why you're in the hospital right now. Uh, now I'm in the hospital because I got transplanted exactly a month ago, May 9th. A month ago, and yet you had that device 24-7 for over a year. What was that like? Uh, it was kind of stressful at the beginning because it had to get used to the noise. It was a, a loud noise 24 7. Like, it's like a heartbeat. So then, after I got used to the noise, I could finally go to sleep. Then, after that, I got used to having, I had to get used to having to carry three extra bags everywhere I went. So it was like, you got to have all this stuff every time you move. You're connected to a line. It was so much. Oh my gosh, how did you do basic things like take a shower and sleep when you have your heart in a backpack? Well, because it was electric, you couldn't really get in the shower, so I had to take pretty much wash ups and bird bath. And then you found out that you were going to get a heart transplant. How has your life changed? My life has changed a lot, I feel. Like, I was happy. Then I was scared again. Like, then they got to open me back up. I just wanted it to go well. And how long do you have to stay in hospital? I should be leaving before the week is over. The next few days. That is great news. And, and would you recommend for other patients who have this same condition uh, to try out using the Syncardia device? Yes, I would recommend it because it, uh, if, you have, if your other organs are sick, it will bring them back to where you will be 100% healthy and ready for transplant. Well, all the best to you. Stan, uh, Stan Larkin joining us this morning from his hospital bed, and we wish you, uh, you, we wish you all the best with your, your new heart. That's exciting. Okay, thank you.